Hello, you're welcome. How to solve this nice exponential equation? Solution from here. And what we have here, we take the log on both sides. That is here, this becomes log a raised to power x equals to log 96 from here. The next step, we apply the power of log room. And when we have log m is to power p, the same thing as p log m as this yeah this becomes x log 8 now equals to log 96 on this side and uh, before we continue you are watching us here at master team at last and do it to watch this video to the end in order to enjoy it maximally then don't forget to subscribe don't hesitate to click on the subscription bell and thank you for your support. The next step here, we divide both side by log it. That is, divide this side by log it. Also, divide this side by log it. That is, here, log it cancelled each other. We have x left, which now equals to log 96 over log 8. Then, from what we have here, we can write 96 as 8 times 12, which implies what we have becomes x equals to log 8 times 12 over log 8. Then, this follows from the log log room. When we have log a times b, the same thing as log a plus log b that is what we have becomes x equals to log 8 plus log 12 over log 8 then next step here we separate this into two fractions now we have x equals to log 8 over log 8 plus log 12 over log 8. Then next step from here, we have log 8 cancel each other. So this one left here. Then we have x equals to 1 plus log 12 over log 8. Then, also here, we can write 12 as 4 times 3. Don't stop watching, continue watching. Of course, you find this interesting now. Here, this becomes x equals to 1 plus log 4 times 3 now over log 8. Then also this follows from the law of logarithm. And what we have becomes x equals to 1 plus log 4 plus log 3 over log 8. Then next step here, we can separate this as well into two fractions. And we have x equals to 1 plus log 4 over log 8 plus log 3 over log 8 and from here we can write 4 as 2 times 2 that's 2 square and also 8 as 2 times 2 times 2 that's 2 cube that is all we have becomes x equals to 1 plus log 2 squared over log 2 cube plus log 3 over log 2 cube. Then okay, here we apply the power of logarithm. 2 comes here, 3 comes here, and also 3 comes here. And we have x equals to 1 plus 2 log 2 over 3 log 2 
plus log 3 over 3 log 2. Okay, from what we have here, log 2 cancelled each other. We have 2 over 3 left, which implies x now equals to 1 plus 2 over 3 plus. Here we can write this as 1 over 3 multiplied by log 3 over log 2. That is, what we have here, 1 plus 2 over 3 can be written as 1 over 2 over 3, which is the same thing as 5 over 3. That is, what we have becomes x equals to 5 over 3 plus 1 over 3 log 3 over log 2. Then we can write this applying change of base. When we have log a over log b, this is same thing as log a to base b. That is, we have x equals to 5 over 3 plus 1 over 3 log 3 base 2. Then also, we can bring this together as one fraction. And we have x equals to SEM here, that's 3. Then here we have 5, then plus log 3 base 2. Then the value of x here, we have 5 plus log 3 base 2 all over 3. Then let's check here if this satisfies this given problem. That is, we substitute. The value of x here, which is x equals to 5 plus log 3 base 2 over 3. Then what we have becomes 8 raised to the power 5 plus log 3 base 2 over 3 is it equals to 96 on this side. Then from here, we can rewrite it as 2 raised to power 3, which is raised to power 5 plus log 3 base 2 all over 3. Is it equals to 96 on this side? Then here, this power multiplies and 3 here comes to each other. And we have 2 raised to power 5 plus log 3 base 2. Is it equals to 96 on this side? Then when we apply the law of indices from when we have a raised to power m plus n, this same thing as a raised to power m times a raised to power n. That is, we have 2 raised to power 5 times 2 raised to power log 3 base 2. Is it equals to 96 on this side? Then 2 raised to power 5 implies 2 multiplied say 5 times. That's 32. And then a follows when we have a raised to power log b base a, which is equals to b. And here this engine has 3 and is equals to 96 here. Of course, 32 times 3 it was 96, which is equals to 96 from here. Left hand side is equal to the right hand side. And therefore, we conclude that x equals to 5 plus log 3 base 2 all over 3 satisfy this given problem and thank you for watching don't forget these steps subscribe for more videos and turn the description button. share this video give a thumbs up and put your comments see you next class and bye for now